speak only when spoken to. I am hard, but I am fair. The more you hate me, the more you will learn. Joker, cowboy, snowball, private pile, private pile. Did your parents have any children that lived? I bet they regret that decision. You are so ugly, you could be a modern art masterpiece. Hey, howdy y'all. It's John, Somerset, Kentucky. Uh, hadn't had a shout out to Nathan a while, Nathan's MRE. Uh, got something planned for you. Today, we're going to do an unboxing, a prize I won from Jordan at J&K Newbie. And uh, we're going to do a MRE Nation uh, ration, part of the trade with G Shells. Apologies on the last uh, uh, video I done. I said it come from G Shells. Next time I said Gun Dog because I was looking at Gun Dog sticker. So um, it's part of the trade with G Shells. Uh, I sent him some Canadian IMP breakfast and ended up with that and a couple more which have been reviewed. Uh, the MRE Nation is the last one that I've got from him right now. So uh, we're going to figure this out. We'll try to go through and get as much as I can before the camera dies. If it does take two parts, it takes two parts. Okay, no big deal. We'll go from that and I'm going to put you on pause a minute. I love modern technology. Let's try that. Okay, friends, um, got Shalker's knife out here. Uh, awesome camp knife. Oh, I, well, I had the blade open, evidently closed it. Uh, typical United States military meal, can opener, bottle opener, screwdriver, knife, punch all, uh, the whole nine yards. Right now, I think all I need is the knife edge. Uh, first part, uh, won a prize from Brother Jordan, J&K Newbie. Uh, let's see, what's a good way to... Well, let's just go for it. Boy, he taped it up good. UPS and Customs. Okay, I'm going to be careful here. UPS or Customs ain't going to get their hands on this and definitely sealed it. And Jordan to John. I'm not going to do a review on this today. I'm going to do a different review, but I did want to unbox this. Just to let him know I haven't forgot about him. <laughs> I'll tell you what, when you're subscribed to as many people as most of us do, it is difficult to try to get to things on a timely basis. Also, if you perhaps change jobs, it, well, life in general gets in the way. Now, what he sent me was, oh, cool, I got extra FRHs. Awesome. One I had last night was first one I had that actually worked in a hundred years and it was absolutely excellent. I can always use extra flameless ration heaters. I went back to the basics on the last review uh, trying to teach some friends how to use a flameless ration heater. First strike energy bar. Oh, cran raspberry. Oh, that's, that's a good one. Thank you, Brother Jordan. We got... Oh, God. Other extras before we even get to the meal. Beef stew. Awesome. 91st day of 2019. Okay. Now, the main meal that I won from him, I had my choice of three. The other two I already had here. Uh, if menu 17, pork sausage, patty, maple flavored. This is an absolute awesome ration uh, due to being a diabetic. It's, I'm not going to do that today. I've already had enough carbs and sugar. I, I ain't going to push my luck. I'll get to this one very, very soon. 
Jordan, you sent a whole bunch more than just that prize pack. Oh, look at this. Okay. All I was expecting was the one prize pack. Cheese spread. Peanut butter. You had the beef stew. Extra flameless ration heaters. And I, no one could ask for a better prize package. Thank you very much, Jordan, from J and K newbie. Uh, like I said, I'm not going to do yours today, but I will do it soon. Uh, I've got to get back to uh, another meal, and I'm going to put you on pause just a second, friends, and we'll get back to this. Or not. Modern technology at its best. Okay, friends, much like fern bark, I do not have luck with these where it says peelable seal. So I'm just going to use Shawker's knife and do it that way. Meal is courtesy of G. Schultz. And uh, it come from MRE Nation, as well stated, Black Dog Bob. Y'all know him, or most of you do. Some of you better than others. They always have extras in heat these. These are absolute awesome meals. Let's see what we got. What do you say? Okay. Now I can, okay, first of all, we'll leave a little stack like that. We have, uh, at one time, he used some of the MRE Star products to make the MRE Nation meals. I believe that has changed. But what I have, um, I believe we've got a spoon, napkin, uh, salt, pepper, crushed red pepper, and I believe there'll be a coffee or something either in this one or in one of the other accessory packs. We'll set that aside and they'll open it later. Um, Flame ration heater, rock or something. Well, I don't know how that does. And if you don't, go back to my last review and you'll find out. Oh, standard pack. Cool. We'll come to that again in a minute. Um, garlic mashed potatoes. I don't know if that shows or not. Heading sleeve for... Barbecued beef. Oh, shredded beef in barbecue sauce. Apologies. Um, the actual contents of the shredded beef and barbecue sauce. We have another cran raspberry flavor. First night. Nutrition bar. Energy bar. We have, uh, what do we have here? MRE trans fat free marble pound cake. That sounds good. I don't believe I've had that in a meal. I've had some of the others, but I don't think I've had the marble pound cake. Sweet. Okay, now going into the other packs, let's let's go back to this gentleman right here. We have Napkin, off to the side, definitely need to be used. Creamer. Crushed red pepper. I love red pepper. I love pepper. I love salt. Anything to make these meals a little more interesting. Uh, moist towelette. Salt and pepper. Sugar, MRE Nation Spoon, and these are as tough as the original MRE spoons. Just a little bit different shape, but they are they are tough and they are strong. They are excellent. And then a little pack of Smarties, very cool. I have dessert. 
along with that and the first strike bar. Now let's go back and see what standard pack 4 is. 740 calories. In theory contains cheese spread with bacon, peanut butter, grape jelly, tortillas, grape drink mix in a hot beverage bag. Again, we will use Shalker's knife. Hopefully, without losing a finger in the process. Um, tortillas. Good to go with this meal. You've got a beverage bag. In the standard uh, United States MREs are called hot beverage bags. You can use them hot or cold. These are like Canadian. They are gusseted and they will actually stand up. On. Well, if I could get my big fat hand in there, it would stand up on its own. These are also good for carrying leftovers or making water bags, carrying water or other supplies. Absolutely excellent. Um, deep rich coffee. We have peanut butter, which I will have to knead and massage. We have grape jelly. We have great flavored drink mix to go along with it, and we have if I can get that in focus, cheese spread with bacon. So we have cheese, we have peanut butter, we have jelly, we have tortillas. We can make a peanut butter and jelly tortilla, a cheese tortilla. Uh, we can use the tortillas with the main and the sides. We have a veritable plethora of options here. Uh, I'm gonna put this on pause just a minute and we'll come back. This is gonna be a long-winded review. I'm sorry, those of you, yes, I am long-winded as you quite well know. And this one, I had the intro I had the unboxing and now we're going to attempt to do a meal. So just bear with me and we'll get done what we can. I'll be right back. Okay friends, um, the last meal that I done, I showed how I was taught to use FRH. I went through that due to giving some meals to some new friends at work and letting them explore the possibilities of our community. This time I'm going to do things a little bit different. Uh, like I said, i done the original way how I was taught. Now this time we will attempt, mind you, to do the Rocky Rob method. This has also been taught up at Gun Dogs at the Meeting of the Minds when all the reviewers got up there. And this is one another way to perhaps do this. So once again I will put okay that's the mashed potatoes. Let's see. That is the shredded beef and barbecue sauce. We will in theory fit yeah I know like I said, need bigger FRHs to do it and the hot water bag. I'm going to have to do part of this off screen, friends. I apologize. Um, okay. We have a heating pad on the back. The main is in there. Now, on the other side of that main, I'm going to put the garlic mashed potatoes again with great difficulty off camera. Okay, 
Got the main on one side, potatoes on the other side, heater pad right in the middle. Off camera, I'm going to add just a little bit of water. And more went in my lap than did the pouch. Marvelous. Well, I guess I, well, there's nobody here but the dogs. I've got to explain why I've got a wet crotch right now. So, I guess y'all trust me that I spilled water rather than having an accident. Um, I'm going to start this first, just here on Renee's Rock or something. Thank you. Several are out there. Mine's the first. That, look at that. Now that's how, oh God bless America. Shoot. Uh, friends, I believe we have a good famous ration heater here. <laughs> I've had bad luck, but right now, the last two meals have been, oh, look at that. Water and an FRH. We'll put that in the, God bless America, that's hot. And I'm, I'm going to heat the tortillas up just a little bit too. We'll shove that in the sleeve. Doggone it. And we'll put that in the bag. I think you can see the steam. Everything is insulated. It's getting nice and hot here on a rock or something. And I'm going to put it on pause now that you know it's working. And I'm going to take it outside. And then I'll start working with the other ingredients and get some coffee and some drinks and get everything ready for when the food gets done. I'll be right back. Okay, we're back live again. Uh, save you some time. Uh, some of the items I opened. Um, let's see. We'll do our grape flavor drink, which I have not opened yet. Add it to a nice frosty mug here and just from the sound of it that is sugar based not the aspartame so it's going to take a little while for it to mix up in that cold water I can even as I am stirring for it let's change that a little bit yeah there we go as I am stirring uh, there is sugar grit in the bottom of that so it's just going to take it a little while to mix up we'll do that and set it aside. We'll wipe off our spoon. And, oh Mick, yep, spill water again. Just turn it up to show your signature. Y'all ought to be used to that, Brown. me making a mess, that's part of it. Um, we will make some coffee deep rich brand this time we will inspect I know you can't see but okay it looks like coffee there's nothing quite green or out of the normal on that yeah, maybe slightly compromised that's yeah. there's no mold but it Definite crispy crunchy. <laughs> That's okay. If it ain't moldy, they'll still eat. And I'm gonna. Oh, that's most towel it. I'll add some sugar. I like sugar. With your all's permission, I will not do the creamer this time. I'll save that back for another time. And my little paper towel. Let's try to soak some of this up. Okay. 
I can remove the rock or something since I took the flameless ration heater and the sides outside. I will set out the first strike cran raspberry flavor bar. Oh heck. I love them things. I gotta get a bite. Sorry. Yeah, I'm still chewing. That's some tough stuff, but boy, it is good. One of the best flavors there are. I'm on out and check on the flameless ration heater, the main, and tortillas, and the mashed potatoes, and I'll be right back. Alrighty, friends. Uh, heater has done nicely outside, as in the previous, uh, God bless America, that's hot. Uh, last review, shoot. Uh, the chemicals that the flameless ration heater use, I'm sure are safe. I still prefer to wipe them down. Iron oxide, aluminum oxide, uh, well, you get the idea. It definitely don't hurt just to uh, kindly neaten things up and take a little less chance on getting some bad stuff into your system. Tortillas coming out. Oxygen absorber. All good for it. Look, look how soft them are after being heated. No breakage. Awesome. 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 Let's see. And this pack is the garlic mashed potatoes. Off screen. I'm going to slide that down after I need it up a little bit. And Terraline goes this way on this particular package. Horizontal instead of vertical. We'll do that. And maybe. Ah, there it goes. There it goes. And the shredded beef barbecue sauce. Which way does it go? Mm, okay, again, there's the little tear notch. Horizontal instead of vertical. Again, off screen while I fight and make a fool out of myself. Oh, go on, that man is hot, y'all. Shoot. Okay, let's try to put things back in frame. Sorry, I moved the camera around so much. Um, like I said, it's not just a review, it was an unboxing and a bullshit session and everything else. Okay, uh, what I'd like to do, with your all's permission, number one, take about half a tortilla. We're going to use a grape jelly. Set the side. And a little peanut butter. Do a little... Whoopsie. Um, PB and J wrap. I think I'm wearing more than what I'm going to be eating. That's okay. That's what napkins are for. Um, 
other half of the tortilla. I've not had cheese spread with bacon in a long time, so I would like to use a little bit of that. Well, I did need to do it, but it's a little bit solid. That's okay. I'll still eat y'all. Looks pretty good to me. I was going to put some cheese in that after a while. We'll just do it now instead of after a while. The rest of it will mix and match as we go. Oh, I forgot. Uh, marble pound cake. Well, let's make room for that. This has been a very plentiful meal, courtesy of G. Schultz, who he got from Black Dog Bob up at MRE Nation. And another tribute to G. Do not eat oxygen absorber. And yet, hell, well, that come off my hand. Oh, Dad, blame. That's good, y'all. That is good. Okay, let's stir the coffee one more time. Stir the grape drink one more time. And I can still feel sugar on the bottom of that. So. It's supposed to be used with 18 or 20 ounces of water, and I maybe use 12, so... Still pretty good and pretty potent. Okay, we'll try the snacks before we go to the main. Um, bacon cheese wrap. Awesome. No problem, friends. Also, peanut butter and jelly wrap. Same way. May not be pretty, but I'm sure it'll taste good. And it does. Messy Marvin syndrome. Mm. Battery slowly dying. Actually, not slowly, but however, it's dying quickly. So let's try to get a little, a little bit more garlic mashed potatoes. No problem with that. Barbecued beef, shredded beef with barbecue sauce. That, friends, is excellent. Now I know what I'm going to do with that. I like my barbecue. I like shredded beef. And let's see, where's that's the cheese right there. Once again, it may not necessarily be pretty, but I guarantee you it tastes good. All the components individual are good and put together in a tortilla. Yep. That works. Battery flashing. Let's try to hurry it up. Um, first strike bar cranberry. Uh, cranberry. 
strawberry raisin, I forget which. Anyway, this is one of the best flavors. Tough on an old man's teeth. Uh, marble pound cake. Excellent as well. Grape drink. A good tasting, y'all. This meal, courtesy of G. Schultz, uh, coming from Black Dog Bob, Simpsonville, Kentucky, just a little bit farther to the north than I am. I gotta get up there one of these days and aggravate them. This is an excellent meal. Uh, any of the MRE Nation meals always have extras with them, uh, extra accessory pack, some, something different. So it's as. Oh, and the dogs next door are starting to sing the choir. Okay, I'm going to get off here. Uh, mashed potatoes, excellent. Beef, excellent. Cheese. Uh, peanut butter, jelly. Pound cake. Um, first strike bar, excellent. Coffee, actually better than I thought. It was a little compromised, but it still tastes good. Uh, grape drink, no problem with that. Uh, thank you, G. Um, Thank you, Michael, for the cut. Um, Shalker, for the knife. Um, didn't use it today for an MRE. Uh, my titanium spork, courtesy, Art and Nina. Uh, Trey, um, Ben and Candy at Animal Free MRE. If you've not checked them out, please do. They prefer a vegetarian or vegan lifestyle, and there are meals, rations, that are suited to their liking. Um, one of these days, I'm going to get on and just mention everybody's name, all the way from one end to the other on everybody I'm subscribed to. Uh, Jordan, Jan K. Newby, thank you for drawn my name. Sometimes I win a few in a row and it's a long dry spell in between. But yours I won and I thank you greatly. I will get to your review soon. At least we got the unboxing part done so people can have some fun on that. I'll tell you what, until the next time I see you, this is John from Somerset, Kentucky. Um, I wish you all peace and prayers. Hope you and yours and everybody is doing well. Till the next time we meet, uh, be safe, enjoy, and I hope you got a little bit of a laugh out of today between the start and the middle and the ending. So, friends, if you need me, just deal. Bye, y'all.